Parliament resumes on Tuesday and we will be taking action immediately to do everything we can to get Parliament to declare what it's already done twice, which is its opposition to a no-deal Brexit, and do everything we can to get a measure through Parliament to stop the government taking us out without a deal. Kia has worked extremely hard as our Shadow Brexit Secretary and obviously as uh, a very well qualified lawyer is across all the detail of it. So yes, it is the chance and we will do absolutely everything we can to prevent a no-deal Brexit and the Prime Minister taking us into the hands of uh, Donald Trump and a trade deal with the USA because that is the real agenda of the Prime Minister. The parliamentary timetable is very short, uh, I recognise that, and as I say, we will do everything we can to prevent a no-deal Brexit, and if that means Parliament sitting longer, so be it. The important thing is that Parliament, having twice voted, on the second occasion by a very large majority, to oppose a no-deal Brexit from the European Union, now has to assert itself a third time, because Boris Johnson has suspended Parliament or tried to suspend Parliament from the week afterwards until the middle of October, which obviously makes it very, very difficult to do anything after next week. So our window of opportunity is Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday of next week as it stands. I've lived there my whole life and it's sort of a, a, an old mining area just outside of it. Uh, but I do think it's important that Boris Johnson understands that we elect a parliament in a free democracy in order to hold government to account. His finding parliament inconvenient is a problem for him. His answer is to try to shut down parliament. Our answer is that parliament must assert itself on behalf of the people of this country to prevent a no-deal Brexit. No-deal Brexit would be very, very damaging trade, jobs and regulations within our society. Boris Johnson as well. he was opening a housing project in my area. So what he told me, because of the work that he does and the empathy with which he reaches out to people